please welcome the creative director of Project Natal, Kudo Sonoda. All right, thanks, Don. Um, so, <laughs> thank you. So Don challenged us to think beyond. And what did beyond really mean to our team? Well, we wanted to build experiences that no matter what your age or gaming ability, you could instantly jump in and have fun, while providing core gamers a level of control they never dreamed possible. Experiences where you have total control over your in-game character just by moving your body or using your voice. You have control over your avatar in the most natural way imaginable. So we got some early prototypes that we want to show you that really illustrate our vision. This tech demo, it's a full body athletic and competitive activity that we call Ricochet. So let's jump in. All right, so the great thing about Ricochet is how fast anybody can jump in and start having fun. There's no controls to learn. You already know how to play the game just by knowing how to move your body. The simple point of this game is to destroy the bricks at the end of the hall. It's like a 3D breakout where your body controls the ball. So Abigail, why don't you take it away? So you can see right away the things that can only be done with Natal. Abby's got full control of her avatar just by moving her body. No controller required. But hey, this demo, it's not just about waving your arms. You can also move around freely in 3D space. So we don't have to set any of the movements for you in the game. She's free to move wherever she wants. She can move in and out to hit the balls harder. She can move left and right to keep the balls in play. And when you combine this kind of full avatar control and the ability to move around freely in your living room, you're going to get true physical play. Nice kick serve, Abby. So besides being super fun to play, Ricochet also keeps you in great shape. You can see by the nature of the game, she's constantly moving around. With all the multi balls, she has to keep extremely active to keep the game going. This isn't a game where you end up on the sofa just using some kind of preset waggle commands. All right, nice job, Abby. And now with the power of the 360, developers get the full body tracking and the precision to build deep layers of gameplay. So we're using real world physics to calculate how each ball reacts to her body. So she can aim to hit those multi-ball power-ups you see down at the end of the hall, or you can just add more power by hitting the ball harder to generate all those fireballs you see on screen. Awesome job, Abby, let's give her a hand. So Ricochet is currently single player, but our technology will also allow us to track multiple people so we can make all games a multiplayer as well. So this next tech demo we're going to show you highlights the purely creative and collaborative types of experiences you can build with Project Natal. We call this demo Paint Party. Paint Party is a 3D art demo where you can use your full body motion and voice recognition to express, express your inner creativity. So to show off Paint Party, let's welcome Darren Bennett, a creative director at Microsoft Game Studio. Hey, everybody. Thanks, Kudo. So uh, up on our canvas here, we have our inspiration image. It's an African elephant on the plains of Kenya. So I'm feeling inspired. Uh, let's splat. So you see, there's my big canvas. That's where we're going to paint our background. Uh, light blue. I'm going to slop around some paint with my bucket throw here. That's my sky. And then I think I'll put a uh, great big cloud up in the sky, white. So I'll throw another bucket up there. There's my cloud. Now I'm going to go to the, some one-handed gestures and uh, paint some mountains in the background. Blue. OK. All right. There's my mountains. Now let's put, uh, let's put some earth down. Dark brown. Oh, there we go. So painting my ground. Then I'm going to want some brown. And I'm going to just lay down a little extra texture on there. And if I get some uh, light brown. All right, a little more texture and color in there. Uh, and then I think I want a tree line in the background. Could I get some green? All right, there's my tree line. So. 
I think that's a pretty awesome background, but uh, I'm not quite satisfied yet. I want to put a, tr a tree up in the uh, foreground. So could I get brown and make my trunk? Sweet. All right, now uh, I'm going to put some palm leaves on it. Uh, green. So there we go. A little finer strokes with my hand. Put some palm leaves on there. Not even sure there are palm trees in Kenya. But there we go. OK, so I'm stoked on my background. And now I want to make the elephant. And so I'm going to say pose. That brings in my stencil paper. And you can see I can use my whole body, make any kind of crazy pose I want. And if you have any friends or family in the living room, you can invite them on in. And they can help you make some art as well. And since I'm making a four-legged animal, I need some help. So Abby, would you like to come back up and help me make my elephant? OK, so here we go. <laughs> All right, so there's our elephant. All right. Let's get to have a little snack. Right? Check it out. Have a little grass. Tastes good. OK, and so now we're going to take our stencil. So ready? Cheese. All right, so there's our elf. Thanks, Abby. OK, so now we're going to paint them in. Elephants are gray. Throw a couple more buckets up there. Now I'm going to sandwich my uh, stencil with my background when I say reveal. And there's our gorgeous masterpiece. Thanks. All right, great job, Darren and Abby. Let's hear them for them one more time. So as you can see, when it's all, we can deliver experiences that can't be done in any other medium or on any other console. We got full body control of your avatar, being able to move freely around in 3D space, using your voice naturally as a part of the experience, and all without a controller. Project Natal work with all Xbox 360s and development kits are arriving at our partners today. And with that, I'll turn it back over to you, Don. Great job, Kudo.